start with a photo of me for going. She's our rep for the Department of Commerce here on the shore. She's the one who founded Tourism Arts and Downtown Development. And I promised her I would give her her 15 seconds of fame. I'm sorry she wasn't here this morning to uh, see that. So Eat, Drink, and Buy Art, as I said, is a project of TAD. And it started out on Maryland's Eastern Shore. And it included towns that are a Main Street or a designated arts and entertainment district. And uh, we had quite a few of those. And as it got more popular, it became Eat, Drink, Buy Art on Delmarva. And we had a lot of Delaware interest. And a few years ago, uh, it became a Delmarva-wide. Uh, Del Delaware adapted their own criteria for their towns that, that, that participate. And they currently have six. And here you can see all the towns on Delmarva from New York in the north to Snow Hill in the south. Uh, we hope our marketing efforts connect art lovers and visitors to Delmarva. We meet quarterly in a different town on the second Wednesday of the month. And these meetings, the town usually uh, hosts some sort of show and tell, some special projects. We like to share ideas and network and feel like we really gain a lot by getting together and working with each other. This is a screenshot of our website and uh, eatdrinkbyart.com. It showcases galleries, artists, eateries, museums, events. Uh, the site was built and paid for equally among all of the partners in 2011 for a cost of $140 each. This is a screenshot of all the towns, so anyone interested in any particular area can click on a town. Uh, it's interesting to note that we don't mention counties, we don't mention state lines, because that's the way real people travel. Uh, after the website, we created a rap card, and that was to uh, head people to the website. We printed 35,000 of these. Uh, this effort cost each town about $110, Everybody can get an equal share. Uh, newsletter, we did next each month. Over 1,000 subscribers receive an email newsletter. One town gets top billing, uh, featuring various things in that town. And um, then we got into social media. We started with Facebook. All participating towns have a designated administrator, so each town can post items as they want. Uh, we recently got on Instagram and Twitter. Uh, each town pays $150 per year for the website and social media posts. Uh, one of the items we like to promote on our website and on the social media pages is our art strolls. Almost every town has one, so it's something we have in common. This one is Third Friday, third Friday in Salisbury. And next, we did a mobile app, and uh, this provides all users with listings on our website. Uh, they can get phone numbers, maps, directions, web links. It's available both Apple and Google, and that was $250 per town to participate. Uh, this is a screenshot of the individual artists page. Um, this is, um, we, we feature uh, artists on a uh, radio program, and uh, you would be surprised how much talent you have in your community. If someone were to scroll through these artists and click on them, there are, we, we keep them all archived so, so they live on the site forever. You would get a video, and that video is about a seven minute video talking about their art. And I, I have watched many of them, and. They're really, really very moving. We, we love promoting our local, our local arts. So, this is our eighth anniversary. We've been doing this since 2008. Uh, we can't believe we've been working together for eight years and we're stronger than ever. And looking back, we have really had a lot of fun. So what is next? We're working on having a fully mobile website. We feel this is the way to go, and it may eclipse the apps at some point. We also want to engage the merchants more through special promotions for visitors and shoppers. And to do that, we have created a little window cling. It's a vinyl decal that the uh, merchants will post in their windows. And we hope that this will also get the merchants more aware of the Eat, Drink, Buy Art uh, campaign. So to wrap it up, we have uh, done all of these things, and if any of you are wondering, uh, keeping track of what it has cost each town, it's 
cost over the eight years $650 per town to have all of these items. And in 2015, we were awarded the uh, best media and PR campaign by the Maryland Tourism Council at the Maryland Tourism and Travel Summit. So hats off to all of our Eat, Drink, Buy Art members, and uh, thank you for joining us.